Hello, crystal lovers. This is Copper Knight. And I'm Pam, the Heartbeat of Sacred Stone. And I have to do a little disclosure right up front here. I'm so embarrassed. I actually thought that, um, well, actually, I've been calling this New Might for a very long time. Um, didn't get uh real specific with the location and I will um, explain that to you in just a moment um, uh, the bottom line is I screwed up um but I'm not alone I'm with a lot of people who often mistake Cooper Knight for new my astrophyolite our feds night um, they all have these fun, flashy things in them. You can't really see that without that flashlight. So, yeah. Um, I'm not award winning any awards this week for my videos. I apologize. Um, uh, but all of them have needle inclusions. Some of them are copper colored. Others are silver and blue. It's a whole nother video. I just want to talk to you about the delicious benefits of Copper Night today. I will say, I will say that origin matters. Origin matters a lot. I've been fooled more than once by this or surprised before. Some stones and crystals have obvious differences depending on the origin. Like for instance, aragonite is blue in China. It looks all spidery, flashy, and starlight in um, uh, with brown, and and it's in fun kind of barrel starbursts in Morocco, and it's a creamy lemon pie kind of um, frozen filling uh, when you look at it from uh, the Zion area of Utah. Completely different stones. And, um, and I would show you those, but I don't know where they are right now. So, um, but if you look them up, they will all have, Aragonite will have all of these different uh, looks to them from different localities. Um, Coprite and Numite, along with Astrophylite and Arfedzonite, they all look very amazingly similar. <clears throat> but what's important to know today is that yours truly got a little confused about whether they were long striations, short striations, what the specific colors of the flashes were, and of course, the energy. The energy of carbonite is much gentler than uh, some of those other stones. Um, and and when you when you hold them you 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 really feel you really feel the difference. And and honestly and I'd, I'd only had one original Numite in my hand and um, I wasn't paying that close of attention. So the point is if you have one of these babies from us that you've purchased from the booth in the past you really have copper night and not new might. So um, send me a, a direct uh, message me or, or send me a picture of your stone and I will send you the correct card that goes with it. Um, and now we're going to talk about copper night. It's a love stone. Not really like a rose quartz or emerald. It, it, I call it the dance of love. It shows us how quickly, effortlessly, joyfully, emotionally we can move through life while staying, staying wrapped or grounded in that central essence, that all-encompassing, the, the big picture of unconditional love. <clears throat> Excuse me. Copper Knight keeps us wrapped and grounded in our origin. That's why origin is so important, folks. Because our origin is love. It, it, shows, it shows us that we can travel through, move forward, time, space, continuums. All of that 
without really having this human thing that we get all wrapped up in about fear of losing the past. It reveals our own natural tether. We have our own natural connection that's not going anywhere. It's it's 100% always, always, always. We are entwined in that pure, limitless love. Uh, or what Neil Donald Walsh would call God. The experience of that, of being completely free, completely free without without judgments without requests requirements and totally secure and totally totally secure at the same time in that love it's kind of wow it's kind of terrifying a little bit exhilarating all at the same time it's that experience that we call feeling alive. And it's so big sometimes. Sometimes we mistake it. You know, a lot of times, you all, we mistake that exhilaration, that excitement, that knowing that we are in a body and having this magnificent physical experience that we chose, that we stepped into, that we created, that we wanted, sometimes we experience that as anxiety. And here's the thing. If you check with all the medical people and you check with all the symptoms and you check with all the signs, it's all the same thing. So whether you're excited about going to the theme park today, or you're excited about having a day at the beach, or you're excited about going to that new job, it's all the same excitement. It's amazing how our bodies translate that. And sometimes our heads give it a different label. Anyway, I'm going on and off Here's the special thing about coppernite, um, or sometimes it's called copperite. Um, it's that unlike all those other stones, the ephedsonite, the numite, the, the astrophyllite, it's really much more considerate. It's much more gentle of the human experience. Even in that dance of love that I think it carries us on, that can sweep us up, it really seems to have a sense of just how far and fast we as individuals are willing to experience that vast, boundless love. Uh, because we really, I mean, our deep desire here is to stay in our bodies so we can continue to have those experiences. So this stone can actually show us, reveal to us a newfound security, allowing us to really tap into that place in ourselves. That's perfect, limitless divinity. Of course, it allows us to be here for the complete and utter and only sole purpose of our own creation of experience. That's amazing, isn't it? I mean, Really, when it all comes down to the end of the day, it's all about us. It's all about us knowing. I mean, we really can know that we are unstoppable, that we are invincible in our own expression of love, whatever that is. Whether that's being a mama, whether that's being a child, whether that's being a star on the stage, or whether that's being the support system in ER, or whether that's being the person that smiles at that person that's very tired that you saw in the grocery store today. Meditate with this beauty on your heart. Oh my gosh, such a wonderful experience to just place this beauty right on your heart. Lay on the floor. Get grounded with Earth Mother. Get grounded with yourself. Allow this baby to show you that eternal dance of love. It's so, it's delicious. It's why we're here. It's why when we got birth and we went, whoa, yes, we're human. We get to try this out in the most amazing ways. 
that's really just the physical expression of life as only, as only you can do it. Nobody else can do it like you. It's so, so cool. So, meditate with this on your heart. Maybe, um, okay, maybe pick a mantra that delights you. Um, I'm the peace, the path of all understanding. Or that's always kind of long sometimes. So maybe, and I love you. Or love is all there is. Or you'll find one because you have those fabulous mantras that are just yours, that resonate with you. I am is fabulous. Just I am, I am, I am, I am. But breathing into this stone, okay, so let's just say that you don't have time for all that. Let's just say that you are on your way to work. Or let's just say that you're on your way to work and this wonky thing happened and you're like, oh, I didn't want to deal with that today. Not this. I just breathe into it. This shows us how to breathe into love. Just breathe into the stone. In, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, four. Out, two, three, four. Wait, two, three, four. A couple of times. Not, not hard, not long, not difficult. Just fun, fun, fun. So you all, thank you for stopping by today, you divine lovers of crystals and stoners. I so appreciate you playing with me. I so appreciate you willing to learn with me. I so appreciate you knowing that we all miss miss the mark sometimes. Uh, it's not new, mate. It's, it's copper night. Um, please, please, please describe for more good crystal vibes. And of course, I would also love a thumbs up if you got one. Know that I'm sending you lots and lots and lots of magical Cooper night, endless, boundless, delicious love to experience however you choose to delight and dance with love in the universe. Thanks for stopping by. Ciao for now.